गाइस आई होप यू ऑल आर इन गुड हेल्थ आई एम सुनीता एंड आई वेलकम यू टू माय चैनल लवेबल प्लान इन टुडेज वीडियो आई वांट टू शो यू डिफरेंट वेराइटीज ऑफ सिंघोनियम सिंघोनियम हैज 46 सिक्स वेराइटीज एंड ईच वेराइटी हैज डिफरेंट कलर ऑफ फॉलियर आई डोंट हैव ऑल वेराइटीज हवेवर इन दिस वीडियो आई शो यू फाइव वेराइटीज ऑफ दिस प्लान बिफोर आई स्टार्ट Let me share one important fact about this plant. Syngonium plants not only beautify our house corner with their stunning appearance but also purify air at our home. The first one I would like to introduce is a rare variety of syngonium known as Erythrophyllum. If you see this plant carefully then you will find that its leaves have green color at the top and reddish from the back side. Its leaves have velvety texture at the top. This plant is a slow-growing plant. This plant grows like a vine. You can see its aerial roots here. Since these roots grow from the stem above the ground, that's why they are called aerial roots. This plant likes moisture and can grow well in medium to low light condition. I have also placed it in medium light and it seems to be doing good. This is pink syngonium as you can see it has pink leaves its leaf size is not as big like other syngonium plant as it's a different variety of this plant this variety is a slow growing plant so you can plant them in a small pot and place it on your office desk this is lemon syngonium if you look at its leaves then you can see it has green and yellowish color Its leaves are relatively bigger in the size. This plant is relatively fast growing plant and hardy in comparison to other varieties of syngonium. The fourth one we have here is known as silverfoot or syngonium vandellendi. This is one of the variegated variety of syngonium. This is also slow growing variety of syngonium. You can grow this as a vine. or as a bushy plant in a pot you can see it has beautiful leaves with fantastic silver line on green this is another variegated variety of syngonium in this variety you can see white spots on green leaves this is relatively fast growing plant in comparison to other varieties of syngonium i have two pots of this variety which i have created by root division method Let's talk about care of these plants quickly. You can grow syngonium indoor or outdoor. However, if placed outdoor, then you need to ensure that they are placed somewhere where they receive bright light but are protected from direct sun. If placed indoor, then place them where they can get indirect bright light. These plants like well draining potting soil. You can prepare soil for this plant by adding one part good quality garden soil one part perlite one part coco peat and one part vermicompost these plants have average water needs but should be watered regularly keep the soil moist in the summer months the best approach is to let the top 2 inches of the soil dry and then water fully so that it starts dripping from the bottom pole syngonium plants thrive in the temperature from 15 to 30 degrees celsius you need to protect these plants during winter when temperature goes below 15 degrees celsius you can feed syngonium plants every 2 weeks with a balanced house plant fertilizer diluted to half strength in winter reduce the fertilizing to once a month only syngonium species do well in small pots but if the plant is outgrowing you can repot it in a bigger pot in the spring season you can use standard soil mix containing peat and perlite for these plants it is best to repot them after 2 years prune your plant to keep them in good shape you can do light pruning during their growing season which is spring to summer while pruning do not remove its aerial roots or runners they develop along with the stem as it may result in stressing the plant Propagation through root division is easiest way to multiply this plant. 
when your pot is full with new baby plants then at the time of repotting just divide the plant into two or three this plant may get attacked by scale insects aphids spider mites and mealybugs you can clean its leaves with wet cloth or wash it with pressured water in case it doesn't help then you can use organic neem spray to get rid of these pests take 2 3 ml neem oil and add it into 1 liter water and do the spray this is all about syngonium plants please share with me how do you like this video in the comment section if you like the video then please press the like button and to see more such video please consider to subscribe my channel thanks for watching